Hey guys, Sprout here, welcome back to the channel. Another update video for Arena Breakout for you today. Now, I've got good news and bad news to go through in this video, so if you do us a massive favour, hit that like button, and make sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any updates on the game in the coming weeks slash months. Now, earlier today, Tencent had that annual, I don't know if it's annual, but they had a conference, the 2022 conference. I didn't watch it, because it was at 11 o'clock in the morning or something like that. I was quite busy. It lasted about, I think, two hours or something. Mentioned loads of games that I'm not really bothered about. But they did do a little part on Dark Zone Breakthrough slash Arena Breakout. Now, I know from digging around and the official account announcements and everything that they've now confirmed the Dark Zone Breakthrough release date to be July 13th, which is next month. So not very far away. And both Android and iOS versions are launching on the same date. So it, it, it's good news, essentially. But the bad news is, obviously I have to have bad news as well, is that this is, of course, Dark Zone Breakthrough's release, not Arena Breakout. It is still the Chinese version. So... While you will be able to play it, you will still need a verified QQ or WeChat account to play. But, if you're one of the people I see coming on my videos all the time in my Discord server, you've got a WeChat, you've got a QQ, but you haven't got an account on the game, you haven't got a slot on the server, you don't need that anymore, you just need the account to log in, and you can go ahead and play. So, like I say... Good news, yet bad news. Now lastly, I want to talk a little bit about the global release of the game. Not a lot more is being said about it as such. However, with the full release, that means that pretty much all they've got left to do on the game right now is the translation. Maybe some other things with like Google Play or, or, or the iOS store. But if they're already on the iOS store, I'd imagine it's the same store. I don't know. I don't know how that works anyway. But once I've done all that, it's looking good for the rumour I heard of an autumn release for the game. So hopefully, in the like obviously the 13th of July, then we've got August, September. August, September, around about there marks. I'm hoping for some news of potential global release date. And of course, I am in the content creator for the game WeChat group. And they are in contact with blah, blah, blah. And they, will, they, they have said they'll update us on the global date as soon as possible. So hopefully I do find that out very soon and I'll be able to tell you all that. Anyway, guys, to conclude, July 13th, both Android and iOS, you will need your WeChat or QQ to log in. You can also pre-register for it on the website with one of your accounts. I will link that down in the description below as well if you want to check out the website see what it says and stuff you'll have to translate it though it is in chinese so thanks so much for watching guys appreciate the support please leave a like on the video make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and hopefully i'll see you in the next one very very soon thanks for watching Bye bye